All right, guys, Papa Pepper back once again. More of 50 days to understand the end times more accurately. Today, we got day 42, uh, imminent part two. So again, we're just sorting through verses that I've been told teach imminency, and we're seeing what they really say. Looking for that blessed hope and the glorious appearing of the great God and our Savior, Jesus Christ. Titus chapter 2, verse 13. Apparently, pre-tribulationalists believe that looking for in this verse means to be constantly looking in ever-present expectation that it could happen at any moment. However, prostokomai, the Greek word which is translated as looking for, simply means to receive, welcome, accept, wait for, or anticipate. How many are willing to receive, wait for, or anticipate the next president? How many parents feel the same way about the birth of their next child? These terms do not necessitate in any moment event, and there is no imminency in this cited verse. In a moment, in the twinkling of an eye, at the last trumpet, for the trumpet shall sound and the dead shall be raised incorruptible, and we shall be changed. 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 52. Obviously, this verse is speaking of the same event as when he shall appear, we shall be like him, 1 John chapter 3, verse 2, and... For the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of an archangel, and with the trump of God, and the dead in Christ shall rise first, then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air, and so shall we ever be with the Lord. First Corinthians chapter four or first Thessalonians chapter four verses sixteen to seventeen. However, we never see anything in any of these verses that even implies this is an event that it could occur at any moment. This verse begins with, in a moment, which is very different than at any moment. In a moment only means that when it does occur, which it will, it will only take a split second for it to occur. This is the same message conveyed by the phrase, in the twinkling of an eye. An eye only takes a brief moment to twinkle. This does not say at any moment or at any twinkling of the eye, but rather that when it does occur, it will occur in a moment. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto myself, that where I am, there ye may be also. First, or John chapter 14, verse 3. I'm not really sure how people can convince themselves that some of these verses teach an imminent rapture, but that's what some will claim. I agree that Jesus does say I will come again and receive you unto myself, but there is absolutely nothing pertaining to any time frame or lack of time frame here. He simply says that he will come again. Making this statement in itself does not provide any evidence one way or another. Jesus could have just as easily said, On May 30th, 2066, I will come again. As he could have said, Be ready at any moment, for I will come again. The phrase used does not negate either possibility, imminent or not imminent. Since it doesn't rule out the possibility of a not imminent return, it therefore does not necessitate an imminent return. Ye men of Galilee, why stand ye gazing up into the heaven? The same Jesus which is taken up from you into heaven shall so come in like manner as ye have seen him go into the heaven. Acts chapter 1 verse 11. This verse, like many others, just says that Jesus will come back from heaven. If Jesus was to return at any moment, rather than these angels asking, why stand ye gazing up into heaven? They should have encouraged them to keep watching, for it could be at any moment. Point. Though verses may be cited as proof of an imminent return, they do not seem to be valid. So again, the last two days I was just looking through some verses. People have told me, see, look at this verse. It says he's going to return at any moment. None of those verses teach that. As we've already shown, not knowing the day or hour doesn't mean it could be any moment either. It just means we're ignorant, not that the event is imminent. So got just a couple more days of this study. Hopefully it's helping some of you. I thank you guys for your support. Thank you for helping me along. And then soon enough, I hope to have this available um, out there in the world too. So you guys can get your own copy for anyone who wants it or for any group studies. So, all right. Thank you once again. Pop